Deja, two more wins last week on the road at Northwestern, at Illinois. Take me to the fifth set. It's 14 10. What's going through your mind and on the floor? Um, well, we do this drill in practice every day, pretty much. So, you know, you get into that mode where you have to focus. And you know, you can't make errors. So, you just try to touch the ball. I was in the back row and I was just thinking, touch the ball. You get a win, you come back from the deficit in the, in the fifth set, you get a win. What does that show about this team's maturity level compared to last year? Um, I think last year we lost pretty much every fifth set that we were in, and I think that's a big step that we won. Uh, but I also think we have to look at, you know, we kind of, we had it in the bag and we gave it away. And that's uh, one of the main things that I was looking at about this weekend, um, seeing how we uh, gave ourselves kind of a, a harder time, and uh, I want to kind of get away from that kind of thing. What, why do you think this team has played the way it did in the fifth set? What's different? What's going on on the floor right now from your perspective? Um, I think Meg made some amazing single stuff blocks that really saved us, and I think Dom, Dom being steady and serving the ball on the court and being ready to make digs really, really helped us out there. Talk about Dom in general. She's really establishing herself as one of the, the best Silveros in the Big Ten. What's she doing well? I think Dom talks really well. Um, having her there kind of makes everyone's IQ a little bit better, and that definitely helps me in the back row. Um, being really, really aggressive out there, uh, it's a, a new thing for her, and I, I really like it. You come back home this week. Are you happy to be back in Rec Hall? I'm always happy to be playing in Rec Hall. Uh, we had a couple tough places to play this week, and Illinois is always tough. Um, and I'm really glad to be back in rec and have our home crowd here. Where's this team at right now? What's the biggest thing you're working on heading into this weekend's match against Indiana and Purdue? Um, Indiana and Purdue are, um, you know, tough teams. Uh, they pretty much have a similar lineup as last year. So we're focused more on ourselves and following the scouting report, um, focusing on their key hitters and what they're going to do so that we can be prepared.